Good YouTube, Nate Mass Collector. Uh, quick little unboxing. Uh, I have from Eagle Moss today the Eleanor 8th, 1 8th scale kit, the first two kits. So. Welcome to the official build of the 1967 Mustang Eleanor Collection. Your shipment is here. Eighth inch scale die cast model of Mustang Eleanor, the star car in a 2000 remake of Gone in 60 Seconds. We appreciate your order and make sure to take great satisfaction in owning your official build. So we got the magazine, the poster, and then kit one and two. got the looks like one wheel for sure and we have the front grill fender with a screwdriver looks like it's got its uh, headlamps and everything in here Very cool. Paint job looks amazing on this thing. Uh, here's the poster, which really nothing special. Just the post poster of the of the car itself. I thought maybe it would have been kind of neat to see it like schematic, like they did with the Back to the Future one, a little bit more in depth. Kind of gave you a life-size scale of the of the the build, and then we got our introductory introductory issues. Nice little book. Not big ones like the Back to the Future ones are a lot bigger, but they downsize a little bit. Kind of goes through all the through all the how. How it's being built but look at this you gotta actually boil these tires to get them to fit on right crazy it's got some stuff in there about the movie so so in this the next kit we get um, looks like some some seat parts Carburetor, cylinder heads, disc brake, and the hood. And then on this one here, here we go. This is kind of like I was looking for. So here's the, holy shit, man. So this is the, the life size scale of this thing. And it is going to be massive. Wow. Twenty two point almost twenty three inches long. I think the DeLorean is like something around uh, I don't know if it's about the same size or not, but it doesn't seem like it's gonna be that big. So if I'm just well yeah, it looks like it's gonna be about the same size. I got the DeLorean where I'm at with this thing here. But this is so neat. I can't wait to start building on this thing. It's going to be a little while yet. I'm still trying to get a new little studio area going in my basement so I can get these things set up. Instead of putting it over here, taking it out, putting it over there, taking it out. So I um, just want to do a quick unboxing here. I'll probably get a few issues before I start in on it. But thanks for checking it out. Um, please subscribe if you haven't. And hit the like video or dislike it, whatever you wish to do. And uh, we'll s hit the bell for notifications to be notified of new content when I put it out. And look for the playlist on this one when I start building it. And we'll see you in the next video. Thanks, later.